All right, guys, welcome to a episode of Rad Race Parts. Today, we're gonna talk fuel pump. Fuel pumps, fuel pumps. So basically these episodes are a way for me to kind of introduce you to stuff that you may or may not know. But greater than that really, it just gives me an excuse to buy more parts. So like I said, we're gonna talk race pumps. No, just we're gonna talk fuel pumps a little bit in this episode. Fuel pumps have come a long ways over the years. Um, you know, used to all your factory stuff was an in-tank fuel pump. Uh, several reasons for that, noise, you want to keep the noise down so they'd isolate that pump inside the fuel tank. Uh, the other thing is the fuel itself would cool the pump so you never have to worry about it overheating. Those cars could drive on long trips, so on and so forth. In the race world, for a long time, everything was an external pump. So you had pumps that could pump more fuel than say the ones that came in the factory cars, the factory style pumps. But they were external or outside, they were really noisy. Uh, they didn't stay cool if you're doing long road trips or driving they tend to burn out or you have issues with them and heat the fuel lots of issues it was great for like quick blasts but that was really all they were good for and if you wanted to make big power usually you had to have a big pump well things have changed over the years actually things have changed just here recently uh, technology and fuel pumps has come a long ways one of those is basically what holly is offering now so they have several of these um, this is their fuel cell uh, EFI kit. So it's basically, it's just a drop-in kit. Goes right into any fuel cell. Um, has a little bracket here at the bottom that you can adjust. So this fuel pump itself can have a different depth to it. So depending on how big your fuel cell or fuel tank is, you can kind of adjust this thing uh, as needed. And so this is kind of, this particular setup is kind of an adapter to uh, convert a fuel cell or any fuel, t fuel tank, if you had like a carburetor set up with an external fuel pump, you could convert that fuel tank into EFI with a drop-in factory style fuel pump. Uh, the great thing about these fuel pumps though is that technology in these pumps have come a long ways as well. You can get these things up to like, uh, well I think this one's 460 liters per minute and they're now making brushless motors that will supply enough fuel for like 2,000 horsepower. So really, in a, in a unit like this, you could, you could make like 2,000 horsepower. All in tank, nice and quiet, it's gonna stay cool, you could, get, you could do those long drives, and um, it's got everything you need. Now this particular unit here has a filler on the top. So it's got this billet top to it, you got a filler, you have a uh, fuel out and a fuel return. So your fuel comes out, goes through your system, returns back into here. This thing comes with a tube that basically puts that fuel back in the tank. Uh, it's got your power wires that are sealed up in here. And so you just drop this in a fuel cell or fuel tank. You bolt it up, it actually comes with the gasket and a trim ring that goes underneath it and a filter that goes on the bottom. So really it's everything you need to convert something to EFI or to just convert a fuel cell uh, into this style EFI pump. Now this particular one here will be going on the Bibster. I've talked about it in videos in the past where I bought a fuel cell, kind of modified it, and then this thing will just drop right in. Uh, make This thing will support way more power than I think I'll ever put on this thing. I'm gonna do the exact same setup on the C10, got the Sniper EFI coming for that thing, so once it's here and I start to work on that, I'll be using a very similar setup to this one for that, for that project as well. Like I said, fuel pumps have come a long ways. These things are awesome. You can get them in tons of different kinds of configurations. I'll drop you guys some links in the description. You can go check it out. If you ever wanted to convert, say, an old tank or fuel cell to like a dependable EFI setup, this is the way to go. There you go, the Holly Fuel Cell 
fuel pump module, I guess is what it's called. These things are great. Not very expensive either. I mean, heck, this whole unit is less than some of the race pumps that we used to buy back in the day. So there you go. Hope you dig that. Hope uh, if you hadn't heard of these, now you know. Now you know. Anyway, as always, thank you for joining me. I'll see you guys some more next week. Go do work, son. Mm -hmm.